Well, well, well. Look who decided to show up. <laughs> I know it's been a while. It's been four months to be exact. I think we can all agree that it's been a crazy year for all of us. A little mess here and there. <laughs> but I'm glad to be back. I'm glad to be recording content again for you. Um, I know you're probably wondering what have I been up to, or maybe you're not wondering that. I don't know. But I'll, I promise I'll give you a life update later on. Today, I want to go ahead and focus on showing you a Cosmo recipe, a Cosmopolitan cocktail for the holidays, you know, a little glass full of inspiration so that you can share with your family and friends. Um, and just to give you an insight, I did buy my own bar set off of Amazon. It's about 15 bucks, which is worth it because it comes with a cup shaker and it already includes the strainer. It has a jigger, which is the one ounce and two ounce, and then it comes with these two bottle pours. And it also com comes with a little paper that has a lot of cocktail recipes. So that's where I got this recipe off of, which is very simple. Have I known, would I have known that before I would have been doing cocktails uh, all this time, especially Cosmos. <laughs> uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started. I also have my martini glasses. I bought these at Target, which is $15 for the set of four. Very good deal. And that's what we'll need. Martini glass, you need the vodka. I'm using number 21 and triple sec. Between these two, that's $20. And then you have your cranberry juice. Of course, that's about three to four dollars the most. Fresh squeezed lime or lemon juice. I'm using lemon, I know. You're supposed to use lime, but I'm using what I have. <laughs> and of course, I so, with that being said, let's go ahead and get started with this recipe. What we're gonna do first, get it together, Edgar. Um, we're gonna pour one and a half ounce of vodka. Well, let's start with the ice first. I'm gonna tap off this cup, and I did wash my hands, so. Just a little bit, and enough of ice. That way we can go ahead and shake it and it makes the, the drink a little bit cold. So now, one and a half ounce of vodka. And half ounce of triple sec. It's filling it. Half ounce of lime, the lemon juice. One ounce cranberry. Place this here. <laughs> and then you put your up and seal it right. You're gonna wanna shake it in a circular motion. So the, the shaker becomes cold and that's when you know it's almost ready. <sighs> that should be enough. So you get your martini glass. the last time I tried to do cocktails for my friend. And um, I don't know why when I do two in one, I always end up uh, having a little bit left for the second glass. So I don't know how that happens. Maybe it's just me. So you see this one? Perfect. I am going to go ahead and add a little bit of garnish to it. That way it looks nice. So, you cut the edge of the lime, lemon, 
and then you're gonna cut nice slices and you can do them thin because this is just the garnish so just like this so what I'm gonna do you see how that missing piece there <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and cut from the middle out in that piece that would because I don't want it to be showing so it works out perfectly you see the odds are in our favor so you make a little opening like this from the center out Ooh. seeds so you get your martini glass and then you just go ahead and place it like this and then you have just make sure you remove the the seeds you don't want your guests or you yourself drinking the sea. <laughs> there we go. I'm sorry. Excuse me. So, this is your Cosmo. Look how pretty that looks. Look how this looks. Very classy. Very with it, definitely tasty, and just imagine in your small gathering just walking around with a glass, a Cosmo, and I don't know who needs to hear this, but sis, you don't need another white claw. Go ahead and pick a cocktail up. Make yourself a cocktail, please. Leave the white claws at home, stop drinking them, lay off for a bit, enjoy a refreshing cocktail and yeah I just wanted to go ahead and do this quick recipe for you all because I know that Thanksgiving is just around the corner and we all need a drink with all this lockdowns happening once more but just go ahead and enjoy yourself relax have a cocktail let's go ahead and try it Tastes a bit different with lemon. I would highly suggest you do it with limes. <sighs> but it's still refreshing. <laughs> I would like for you to comment in the comment section what's your favorite cocktail, what's your to go drink when you used to go to a bar or if you still go out to a restaurant bar. <laughs> so I just wanted to get on here and uh, make an appearance. It's good. You yeah, had to. Allow yourself to be desired. Vamos a dejarnos a desear un poco. Pero aquí estamos de nuevo. We are back again. And I hope to continue shooting content for you and keeping you posted, you know, of what's going on. You better, better have enjoyed this video. I'm not giving you no option. I did shave, I did have a haircut. I am wearing black, slick, thin so that quarantine body does not expose me in the camera because I've been told that the camera adds pounds. Well, honey, I'm gonna start weighing myself in kilograms because, <laughs> yes, it's, it, I, I don't weigh myself in pounds anymore. No, kilograms, honey, kilograms. And please, when you are drinking a cocktail, make sure if it has a long neck like this, grab it from the neck. Please grab it from the neck of the glass. Don't hold it like this because with your body heat, you will go ahead and warm up your drink. And besides, this looks more classy. Honey, personal image 101. You're welcome. With that being said, this has been real. I hope you have enjoyed it. Please go ahead, like, share, and subscribe, and stay tuned. Until next time, until the next dose, bye.